Most people don't think about fungi except in the supermarket or in the woods when they see mushrooms. But the majority of fungi are unicellular, microscopic. Those are the ones that cause disease. That's Arturo Casadevall, professor of microbiology and immunology at the Johns Hopkins Bloomberg School of Public Health. And he's the author of the new book, What If Fungi Win? What makes them really interesting is that they are your closest relatives. When you look at the tree of life, the animals, us, cows, monkeys, are closest to the fungi rather than to the plants, amoeba, and things like that. We share a lot of the biochemistry with them. And that actually becomes a problem when you try to make antifungal drugs because they're so similar that we have very few drugs. Resistance continues to be an increasing problem. And, and as I alluded to earlier, the fact that we are biochemically so similar to the fungi, what it means is that it is difficult to find a difference. And if, you, mm. and if it's a difficult to find a difference, the difference is the target. You want to kill the fungus and not kill the person. On today's episode, the science of how fungi are adapting and why we need to prepare for a fungal epidemic. <laughs> 